Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids, and this is my benchmarking video on the brand new mid-2011 Mac Mini. Now this particular model is the 2.5 GHz dual-core Intel Core i5 processor. It's got 4 GB of RAM, 500 GB 5400 RPM hard drive, and that dedicated AMD Radeon HD 6630M graphics processor with 256 megabytes of GDDR5 memory. Now the first test I'm going to do is running Blackmagic Design's disk speed test. Uh, do bear in mind that these tests will be downgraded very slightly because I'm currently recording this video using ScreenFlow so that does affect the results very slightly. Now the write speed there is around about the 60 megabytes per second just peaking at 63.5 actually and the read speed is 62.6 megabytes per second. Now you'll have to take my word on this but when I wasn't running ScreenFlow this was almost peaking at 70 megabytes per second. So let's stop that test and just before I quit out this application Blackmagic Design disk speed test is available free of charge in the Mac App Store. So let's quit that now the Geekbench I've run, I run it in 64-bit mode and again I had to run this before actually starting this screen recording uh, purely because it impacted the result too much. So we have got a Geekbench score of six, uh, 7486, almost said 6000 there, but 7486, a fantastic score actually. Let's just run through some of the uh, other scores here. Processor integer, integer performance, I can't even say that, is 5504. Floating point performance, 10878, that is fantastic. Memory performance, 5436, and the memory bandwidth, 6658. I will be running this test again when I upgrade the Mac Mini to 8GB of RAM. Let's just go down to some of these other scores here, give you a little look. Very good performance scores here down to the floating point scores which is unbelievable 10878 absolutely amazing scores on that front let's go down to the memory performance again acceptable not outstanding but more than acceptable and then the stream performance very good again at 6658 now I have actually submitted these to my Geekbench account and just to put these in perspective I'll give you an idea of of where they lie let's just bring that uh, window to the front again and we have got a score here of 7486 and if I go to uh, Geekbench you'll see that just underneath that so a little bit slower is an Xserve early 2009 also a bit slower uh, iMac 21 and a half inch mid 2011 and that's with a core i5 uh, 2.5 gigahertz four cores so the same speed but four cores is scoring lower than this Mac mini and just above it, so only just beating it, is a 27-inch mid-2011 Core i5, 2.7 gigahertz, four cores, so quad-core iMac, is only just beating this Mac Mini. That is absolutely amazing. The speed on this Mac Mini is fantastic. And at the price point these uh, new Mac Minis are coming in at, they are a bargain buy. Very, very good performance perfectly capable of handling video processing, um, Photoshop work, anything you want to throw at it really. And also great just to sit underneath the TV if you want to use it as a home theatre PC as well. Well thanks very much for watching this video. I will be doing more videos on this Mac Mini including that 8GB RAM upgrade showing you exactly how you perform the upgrade, some more benchmarking tests and then in about a week or two's time I'll be bringing you a full review. Well thanks very much for watching. I'll see you all again in the next video.